I have been saving some packages that have arrived in the mail in the past few weeks so we can do an unboxing together. I have inks here that I want to try, new to me inks, as well as some new drops from some good brands like Wearing Ghoul. And then two sailors here that I've been eyeing for some time and are finally here. And this very unexpected Platinum Nagasawa that joined the family. So let's see what's inside these boxes. Let's begin with the inks and stationary items that I received. The first one comes from Amarillo Stationery. And I wanted to really try the Monarca inks. I mentioned it in my previous video for eight questions, if you saw that, and um, I'm really excited to try both of these. He was so sweet and kind to send me an extra one, and it's in a really nice green, so I'm excited for both of these. We'll swatch both. I was so blown away by these super cute stickers. Tell me these aren't so adorable. I also got this very beautiful, I think it's handmade, and it's this Mr. Rogue. It's called Estuche, which is Spanish for like a little bag, <laughs> I think. It's a leather exterior, which is so nice. And I love the smell of leather. <laughs> and then the inside is lined with this sort of, um, what is this, like wool. So I really like it. It's very, very soft and very beautiful. Let's do a swatch of the inks that I received. So the first one is going to be... Tierra Colorada. And then uh, one of the cool things about these inks that I thought was pretty neat is that they come with a really cool little pen holder here and an ink holder. Okay, the second one is Manglar, which looks to be a beautiful green ink. And uh, thank you, Eric, if you're watching my video, for not sending me shimmer inks. <laughs> I'm not a huge fan of shimmer inks because uh, I just don't want to deal with them clogging any of my pens. Okay, so let's give a swatch to these beautiful um, inks. And I have some Wearing Ghoul swatch cards here. Okay, so I swatched both of the Monarca inks. And uh, let me just say, they are gorgeous inks, okay? They are drying beautifully here. This is natural light. And I love how deep and rich this orangey brown is. And this is the Manglar, which is a beautiful deep green. Next, the two purchases I have are actually from Atlas. Some of these are new. So Geppetto, I think it's one of from the newer collection. I got Peter Pan, very pretty green. And then Heimdall. And then Needle Space by Colorverse. The next set of inks are... Uh, all three are from Lennon Toolbar. So we have here uh, Bird Monster, Coastal Village, and Cat General. And we're going to swatch all of these and see what they look like. Let's start with Space Needle from Colorverse. It's swatching really, really light. It's pretty, it's very pretty. I just wasn't expecting it to be that light. I don't know if I recall it being that light on the website. Okay, next, Geppetto. 
I'm really excited for Geppetto. It's very pretty. Yeah, it definitely reminds me of grapefruit. These are swatching a lot lighter than I had anticipated, but that doesn't mean that it's bad. I'm kind of experimenting with a lot of colors, so I really like the variety of colors it's giving me right now so far. Heimdall. Let's see. So pretty. That's a pretty orange. Peter Pan. Um, hello pretty. Hello pretty. I really like this green. It's like a pistachio in a way. Our next batch. It's all Lennon Toolbar. Let's start with a bird monster. Love it. That's a pretty green. Okay. Coastal Village and Cat General. Cat General looks like an orangey color too. Brownie. I really like this. It's definitely a beautiful burnt orange. All right, and last we have Coastal Village. Okay. Pretty. It's coffee. It's very coffee like. Okay, Lennon Toolbar did not disappoint whatsoever. Now let's move on to our pens. Let's start with the Sailors. I have here the Sailor Fountain Pen Velio in the Pearl Mint. Oh gosh. Look at this. <gasps> so beautiful. What a beautiful jade green color this is. Stunning. And the way it catches the light as you turn it. Oh, that is a stunning pen, you guys. Seriously gorgeous. This minty jade green color is really gorgeous. Beautiful. I know, I say that about most pens I open. But this is truly beautiful. This is just gorgeous. Next, the Wildberry in fine i was trying to get it in a different size but this is the only one that was available in stock and they had run out before i didn't want to take another chance and not be able to get it so i got it in fine which is fine oh it's so so pretty i really love the way they did the smoothie collection you guys because it's really very smoothie like Look at this beautiful soft pink. And then there's those subtle shimmers they always put on most of their pens. <gasps> I love it. It's seriously so smoothie like. It's like strawberry smoothie. No joke. And it's joining these. They're, oh, they're so pretty together. <laughs> this one has the chrome. These come with the yellow gold. But I think it really complements the pen well with this color. So pretty. This one is seriously beautiful. So soft. The color is so soft. I don't think I have another pink that matches this sort of beautiful pinky color. And then the last pen I have here. I was browsing Yoseka's website. While I was scrolling, I came across this pen. And this is called the Nagasawa Original 3776 Pen Style Silhouette. And I got it in the gray ivory. So here is the pen. It's a beautiful grayish charcoal. But look at the body here. Almost the same. I thought it was going to be the same, but it's not. <laughs> they are both matte. This one, however, is as matte as the other one, but this is actually slightly more taupe than this one was. I wanted to really see <laughs> if it was the same, which is why I actually purchased it. And I only found it in the extra fine. That's the only size Yoseka had in stock. 
but I really ended up loving the color when I opened it and thought, yeah, this one's gonna stay. I think they look so beautiful together, sisters here. Okay, that is all for my haul. I hope you guys enjoyed it and saw something new. If you guys have any comments down below, let me know. And I will see you guys on the next video.